It got too snowy in Vermont and New York, the next two states closest to our house. So we looked at the snow cover map and decided that we would try Maryland, which was at a much lower elevation. So here's how that went. So this is our first day in Maryland. We're going to hike north to Pennsylvania. 17 degrees. 17 out degrees here. out. First section of Maryland. Yay. Maryland 17 to Penmar Park. I think we're at Raven Rock which is a pretty cool little area. Check it out. What a tree, everybody carves their name in it. Like an alpine zone. Something new. Graffiti to all the rocks up there. We're at Penmar Park. Looks like there's a ski area way out there. Beautiful park. I don't know if the AT through hikers can stay here. Second day in Maryland. We're actually in Waynesboro, Pennsylvania. Staying at the Days Inn. Quarter of five in the morning. It's what? not quarter of five, it's six thirty. Feels like quarter of five. I'm gonna have some waffles. <laughs> Yesterday was 17 degrees and today it's 9 degrees. We froze to death yesterday, or at least our hands did. Today I have a shirt with a thumb hole. So we went to Olympia, Olympia Sports. Sports and bought down mittens. I'm going in. Yesterday my battery said 60% but my phone shut off as I was trying to save the hike. So today I'm plugging it into a charger. I'm wearing my hokas today because my feet are killing me. I'm taking a water bottle. Yesterday my bladder froze. And I didn't have any water for 10 miles. I got long johns on today over my other pants or under my underpants and then I've got <laughs> two pairs of socks and I'm wearing an extra jacket. Another thing I'm doing is I'm gonna record with my Garmin 910 XT as we're going along. The good thing about this thing is every mile it buzzes so like that and it tells you you did one mile, two miles, three miles, which was pretty good initially but then the miles started seeming to go by very slowly. <laughs> Today we're hiking northbound again from Reno Monument Road to Maryland 17. 14 and a half we're on the Civil War Trail. I-70. Oh. Okay, today because our dog is fairly tired from 15 miles yesterday, sections. we're going to do two sections. We're going to do from Gaplin Road to Reno Monument. That's six and a half miles. Then Weaverton Road to, back to Gaplin Road, another six and a half. So we're at this beautiful park, Gaplin, or actually it said Gathland or something? Gaplin Road, but it's Gaplin Road, Gaplin State Park. And it's 12 degrees this morning. Whatever this was, we built in 1887. Okay, we're only six tenths of a mile in, and I'm overheating again. A lot of Virginia has, not Virginia, Maryland has been really nicely maintained. They've done a lot of work on the trail. What's up, Brad? Gotta stop again. What I seems to, to be the seems problem? like my socks, no matter how tight I make my shoes before the hike, my socks come up. These have a seam that seems to bother my foot. Yeah, it's crazy how many times we have to stop, huh? Yeah. 
It is. I, put, I forget to put my phone on airplane mode. I gotta take a leak. I gotta take my jacket off. What else? Gotta feed the dog. Gotta get your water because it's not gotta in the get bladder. Because it keeps freezing and I'm keeping it in the pack. It's killing my pace. It looks like a fire happened here. And they've got us in these rocks. And Aspen's pretty spry, even though she wasn't looking too spry this morning. She's hunting. Ah, this is another thing. Every this time I bend over, it's I crack see, shows. It <laughs> comes up, and my pack holds us there. <sighs> the life of a slack packer. <laughs> Now if I bend down to pick up my poles, he's gonna, he's gonna, <laughs> my freaking shirt's going to come off. Yeah, so let me try this. <laughs> that didn't work. I'll get it, Brad. Hey, wrong way, herder. This is the way. Come back. Where? Go to the, well, it's your left. Walk <laughs> right by this. Oh. <laughs> Not. <laughs> Not oh, the AT. It's Look at uh, how they did that. I know. I walked right by it though. They should make that orange. And that's what we were heading down. And when we crossed the road, we should have gone. I'm wobbling. That way. The next section we did was actually in Virginia, as far as we could tell. We thought we were going to do some of West Virginia, but we never saw any signs for West Virginia. Hey Brad, it's time to get up. It's uh, 5.30. We got the shuttle person to meet today. Are you getting up? You out of bed after three hard days? And what's, what's wrong with you? My feet hurt. That's <laughs> three... Three easy days on the Appalachian Trail, and that's what you look <laughs> like. It's not really that easy. <laughs> I'll be able to walk in a minute. Oh, you know, my feet hurt. Like, I just hurt. <laughs> <laughs> What's Aspen telling you? <laughs> they, they hurt to pull this way? Yeah, the bottoms of your feet hurt? No, the bottoms no, hurt. See, it's then the tops. It's the tops. It's from well, lifting them up. It's in here. Yeah. It's all in here. That's it lifter uppers. It hurts uppers. to put pressure on them, yeah. as well as... Lift them up. It doesn't really hurt to lift them up. Uh, it hurts to put pressure. Well, is your shoe... We're getting shuttled from Keys Gap to Snickers, Snickers Gap, Gap so that we can hike back from Snickers to Keys. The route we were going to take, we couldn't take because very steep hill and it wasn't plowed at all like these streets aren't. We are following the guy who's giving us a ride who is Chris and he's taking us a flatter route. We're at Snickers Gap and, and look snow. This is what it's like out on the trail today. Here we are at about two and a half miles in. This is some sort of cliffs. 2.63. 2.63 on a snowy day and blowy. It's very cold. And we're going that way. Here we are trudging through the snow. Trudge. 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 Okay, so the camera won't. The lens. Shut off. So we're gonna pull the battery and put it back in. And it closed. Go. I'm getting very warm. It's like a balmy 20 right now when it's been like tens for the high. So it's really pretty up there. After we were done hiking that day, we went to the Appalachian Trail Conservancy Visitor Center and we met the very nice people inside who we talked with for a while and then they said, oh, you're hiking the whole trail. We got to take your picture. So we got our pictures taken and put into the, whatever it is, official AT through hiker book that they keep. In the ATC and this 
is the whole map of the Appalachian Trail. There it is. If you go south, over the Bigelow's. Where are the Bigelow's? Right there. Oh, Crocker. Massachusetts. Oh, I see Pittsfield. We've done this, and we've done this. <laughs> Over the Hudson River. This is day 21. Today we're gonna hike from Weaverton Cliffs in Maryland down to the Potomac River, which will finish Maryland. Then we're gonna go from the Potomac River up to Keys Road, which will finish West Virginia. We're gonna do the walk in that direction, so it's all uphill. It's another wicked cold day on the trail. We are on the Sino Canal and the bridge over the Potomac is over there. I think it would be pretty tough to cross this in the winter like George Washington did. Left, left, right, left, trudge, 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 left, left. <laughs> First they hired me, then they fired me, then they got me, I left, left, <laughs> left, <laughs> left. Where did you get this from? I'm just making it up. <laughs> it's First boring. they hired me, then they fired me? Yeah. <laughs> trudge, trudge. Trudge, 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 <laughs> trudging along on the sea, you know. Trudge, 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 trudge. I assumed we were going over that bridge, or not. We're continuing on. Check out these trees. That says think. Beach. It's 10 degrees out. Somebody's funny. Well, today I'm using my new Ultras for the first time, and they feel pretty good. They feel a lot better than the old ones. I guess the old ones are worn out. They were probably two years old. We are approaching Harper's Ferry, which is way over there. It's like we're crossing up there. Oh no. Uh oh. Away and you might have to help her. Okay. I just had to carry the dog up the steps. That was hard. Whew. Seventy-five pounds. It's not light. Whew. Anyway, here's the Potomac River. <laughs> 